Hey Triathletes, happy 2020. Today we are talking about a new partnership with Biomechanics Labs, a quathlon, lots of club training offerings, and Murray Man, we've got some great news there, don't we, Jase? Is my hair okay? Yeah, it's pretty good. Hello triathlon community. We are here today, Jess, at the Biomechanics Lab at Nord. Um, Dr. Chris Bishop and his team at the Biomechanics Lab have come on board as a triathlon South Australia partner. Jess, how, talk us through it. Look, it's an amazing initiative that we're building over the, over the next six months. Uh, we really want to put together a great suite of partners um, to, to really look after the health and wellness of our members. Uh, these guys, they've got an amazing offering that they can do for people in terms of um, analysis of running, uh, styles, uh, running gates, looking at um, flagging potential injuries, and it really links in with another one of our partners in Joggers World, well, Jase. Yeah, it's a perfect fit for us, we see, and um, they'll be coming to Australia Day, so um, if you want to come to Australia Day, have a chat to them, find out what they can do. Um, the team of, um, here will be there, and they'll be able to answer any questions you have, and more details about this partnership will come out soon. Mm, biomechanics. So a quathlon or aquathon, whatever you want to call it. This Saturday. That's right. So that's being run by Tempo. It's going to be an amazing event, Jase. Yes, Scott, Scott has done an amazing job getting it up and running, bring it back to the bay. So everyone remembers the Sam White aquathon where it was on Boxing Day. This is a couple of weeks past Boxing Day, so you can burn off that Christmas pudding. Um, and then, yeah, it's back at the bay, Jess. What's your thoughts? I love it. I had a lot of prawns. But look, uh, there's one tip. So Sarah Crowley's racing third at Kona. That's an enormous thing. That'd be an, a sight just to watch, Jess. So even yeah. if you're not racing, come out and watch. Numbers are already at about 200, Scotty's been telling us. So registrations keep coming in. Remember, entries close online very soon. Um, but if you want to come see Sarah race or race next to Sarah, I suggest you register soon. So 2020 is already in and the mix of it, Jess, and clubs are starting to ramp back up. Go through some of the options. Oh, look, so, so Lakers have got their 50 days to try. Um, that links in really, really nicely with, with an eight-week um, membership offering that we've got. So jump online, check out their, their training sessions. Nigel Peach is the head coach. Um, it's really, really good. Not just Lakers. Meteors, they've just started up their weekly club training. They've got swimming. They've got cycling at the velodrome. They've got some running. Um, and if you're living out in the northern suburbs, Jase, Trikings have just started a new women's program. What? Tell yeah, me more. That's right. So if you if you go onto their Facebook page, uh, we'll put a link in it on our website and in the uh, in the comment section below of, of this website. But Trikings, fantastic initiative supported supported by the city of Salisbury, I believe. Yeah. Um, so look, there we've got lots and lots of club offerings. So if you think you could, you're only having to train solo, not quite right. There's a heap of club training offerings. It definitely, definitely is the way to go, guys. Jess, Murray Man, hit it up. What's happening? Well, huge news. There's a date change. Has possibly something to do with uh, this giant thing called Iron Man Melbourne. But anyway, we've, it's turned into a really, really good thing. Uh, Murray Man is changing to a long weekend, Jace. So that means you do not have to pack up your bike, pack up your gear, and leave straight after the race. You can stick around with the family, relax after the race with a few beers, and then pack up the next day and head off. Yep, so October 3rd and 4th will be Murray Man. Uh, so there'll be the, the regular long course, there'll be a half Murray. There's gonna be a sprint distance as well this year. And not only that, there are some more exciting news, but we'll let ATC and Tony bring that out for you. That's right, we don't wanna steal too much, too much time though. No. So that's it from us today. Uh, there's lots and lots going on in 2020. Malang Triathlon Festival's in February. Victor Harbour's gonna be amazing. Weepix Kids Triathlon's in April. Jace, I'm pretty excited about 2020. I'm tired just thinking about it all, Jess. See you at the races.